when I was creating this video it made me think of how there are things in life that we don't like doing but we have to do because we want to get to where we want to get for example like who wants to wash a dustbin no one but we need the dustbin to throw away unused material like waste right so i know this example might be silly because you can pay someone to wash your dustbin but there are things in life that you cannot pay for things like if you want to know how to do something you can't pay for that information to go in your mind you have to dedicate time into learning this skill or something somewhere somehow in life we have to do things that are uncomfortable to us to get to the goals we want to achieve and i think it's a good idea to practice things you are afraid of doing to practice things that make you uncomfortable the more you train yourself of doing that the closer you are going to get to your dreams you need to be committed you need to show up for you to achieve the goals you want there are going to be days where you feel like you know what today i don't feel like doing this but because you're committed, you will have to do it. There is a word that is used. I'm not sure who came up with the word. Um, apparently, every type of work has a shit sandwich, they call it, meaning there are things that are uncomfortable or you won't like doing that comes with any type of work for example let's say you would like to help sick people but you are um scared of blood or you don't like blood let me not say you're scared of blood but you don't like blood but if should you go to becoming a nurse or becoming a doctor you are going to have to deal with blood and then it's up to you if you choose that this shit sandwich it's something i can deal with or not meaning when you're choosing any career path or any job that you would like to do you have to think about the shit sandwich is it something you don't mind doing i hope i'm making sense because if you don't like your like you don't like blood but you want to help sick people is seeing blood on a daily basis something you can handle does it make sense i hope i'm making sense i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please give it a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe down below it's for free i will see you guys on my next video goodbye